Hello everyone, Simon here. We're back in Monster Hunter Rise. Hello again, SDKC. An urgent quest awaits you. You've been requested to dispatch an agitated Mizuzune in the Shrine Ruins. Usually docile, we really pay these creatures any mind. However, this particular Mizuzune has gone hopping mad. I just don't get it, get it. The guild will investigate this matter further. Your job is to ensure that the monster is dealt with swiftly. Now hop to it, to it. Um, is it an apex? It better not be an apex monster. SDKC, an urgent quest is coming for you. Your target this time is a Mizuzune in the Shrine Ruins. It may appear majestic and beautiful, but don't be fooled. Hi. These creatures are quite nimble and use the foam they create to maneuver and attack. Uh -huh. They normally don't pose any threat to us, but this particular Mizuzune has become extremely agitated, I wonder why. Now then, good luck to you out there. Um, optional side quest, hunt a monster, urgent quest. Six star Mizuzune. Is that darker than usual? Hold up. What do they usually look like? No, 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 that's normal, never mind. The meal, pay with points. Okay, let's try to be careful with this. It's a six star quest. We don't have that much armor. We got wrecked pretty hard by the Rathian last time. Let's make sure we do this real carefully. Get the um the bonuses. There's a Rathian over here. It's not gonna follow us. So when the monster is enraged, it will follow you. When it's not enraged, it doesn't follow you. It just hits you if you get close to it. Suzune, there she is. She or he, not really sure. Gender non-specific Mizuzune. I didn't think it had such long reach. And also, it took half my health in one hit. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> it just took half my health in one hit. Okay then, alright. I see it. I see what you mean! That was meant to be a foresight slash. But I suck at the game. Okay. Watch the bubbles. Watch the bubbles. Watch the bubbles. It is enraged, I believe. Oh crap. Oh wait. That doesn't hit you? Bubbles. Oh my god. Why does it do so much damage?
Alright, we're in real Monster Hunter now. The monster takes half your health in one hit. Now we're playing Monster Hunter. That's not the right move. That took... 80% of my health in one hit. <laughs> Thanks, Catherine. Thanks for the heal. Now we're playing Monster Hunter. Jesus. Oh my god. Why does it move so fast? I'm screwed, right? I'm not... I'm not getting this. Well, that's nice of you to leave. I mean, if you stayed, I would have died. <laughs> now we're playing Monster Hunter, you guys. Have I, like, neglected to upgrade my armor? Is that what's going on? Foresight Slash. It was. That's where it was. Try to dive out of the way. Um. Why did that? What? That just hit behind it. Now it's bad again. You know what, let me just run away for a little bit. <laughs> Heal up over here. Okay. <laughs> it hits you 
once, then you're dead. Oh, you tired? Are you tired? Not that tired, apparently. Okay, we are finally getting some payback. It hits really hard, right? You have to not get hit if you wanna survive. You know when you're good at Monster Hunter if you don't get hit. <laughs> just just don't get hit. It's pretty mad. Pretty mad. It did not. Oh my god. Oh, what the heck, freaking move. It just sweeps the entire arena? Oh, uh, don't do that. I thought it would stop in one uh, in run round. No, it just kept going. <laughs> it just kept going around. Unbelievable. Well, we cut it. It's pretty serious. Playing real Monster Hunter now. Really? That that water jet just goes around more than more than once? Also, the other two monsters aren't helping. The Mizuzune only stays in the water. And the other two monsters don't come to the water, so we can't get these guys to fight each other. Is it running away? It's running away. Okay, it's going up the the waterfall. Uh, if you cut three times, you fail. Run 
way, heal up. Oh, hi. <laughs> させたね。さあ。ありがとうよ。ああ。ゆうこ。ゆうこ。ゆうこ。ゆうこ。ゆうこ。ゆうこ。ゆうこ。ゆうこ。ゆうこ。ゆうこ。ゆうこ。
much more health could have possibly had. It's so hard. That's real monster hunter. <laughs> you get hit twice, you die. <laughs> Welcome to Monster Hunter, ladies and gentlemen. The real game begins here. In a water orb. Hunter rank six. We have found our answers. The answer to that which has plagued Kamura, the cause of the rampage. And you hunting that poor old Mizu led us to the answer. <laughs> when the guild was investigating the monsters around it, they came across several telltale signs. <laughs> and they were connected to the rampage, the rampage and that azure fiend. <laughs> and that's not all, our scouts informed us that they had spotted that azure beast above the shrine ruins. Shortly after its appearance, every monster in the vicinity became feverishly violent. And that Mizuzune, being in mating season, was intensely affected. We always thought that monsters attacking human settlements was simply nature at work. As it turns out, it was really the work of this monster, whipping all the monsters into a frenzy, causing them to migrate. Mm. That's the secret behind the rampage. Mm. And that's why there were always sightings of that beast shortly after the rampage started. The guild has named this fearsome monster Wind Serpent Ibushi. The cause of the rampage must be slain. Ah. We are sure it won't, la it won't be long before it returns once more. When that time comes, we're all counting on you. While we wait for further reports, please proceed with the newly available six star quests. Yeah. Alright, new rank everyone. Let's go talk to everyone. Yo, whoa, Ace, you've really been thrashing on those monsters out there. Starting to look like a seasoned hunter now. <laughs> But even seasoned hunters need some spicy new switch skills. I know you're ready to dig in, but I gotta warn you: these new quests cooked up have I cooked up have some real have some kick, like Haya. 
Each one of them will put you flat on your butt if you're not ready, so you better lace up your tabby. Learn the longsword. Oh no. <laughs> it's the Visosune, and we also got the uh, Zenoga. Dissect the dual blades. Alright. Grasp the gun lance. Invoke the insect glaive. Be one with the bow. It's a true monster piece. Hello there, Eskizi. I've got some big meals from the canteen for you. We've taken our classic dango and cranked up the taste to another notch. I think you'll be presently surprised by them all. Each one is confirmed to be doubly delicious by the whole canteen team. Well, what are you waiting for? Go and dig in. Alright, new dangos. Joho, how as dependable as ever. Ah, uh, hello there, CKC. A spot of good news for you. The guild was quite impressed by your recent efforts. Joho, -ho, here you go. One guild ticket with your name on it as recognition for all the, your hard work. <laughs> hello, CKC. You're not able to accept six star quests. Please have a look when you have the time. Can you believe that the rampage is actually a large scale migration of monsters? I cannot fathom the degree of power that Wind Serpent Ibushi must wield to give rise to such an uproar. In any case, there's not a moment to lose. We must quell the rampage and put an end to the pain that my sister is enduring. Okay, I guess so. So... Six star? We need to hunt Barrioths? Because the Barrioth armor is the set that we want for our longsword. And then we have to hunt a Naga Nagakuga to upgrade the Nagakuga weapon. And then we have uh, our set for the next stage of the game. There's also that barrier, which is capture. Do you have to use? You don't have to use the weapons. Yeah, no, you can use. You can use a longsword to to grasp the weapons. Hey, get a lot of this. We've all worked really hard, and now we are able to forge more decorations for you. You should check them out. Okay. Your quests are just gonna keep getting harder and harder. Why not have us forge a few for you and slot them in? Probably should. Long sword. 214, 230. Uh, 210, I mean. So another 20 attack. Uh, now we have the Guardian Longsword, so that should help, right? The question is, what other things can we craft? 190... 0... Julian Blade, 180... 0... It's got blue sharpness, but so does, so does this. 230, uh, 230 zero. Oh, we're not gonna be able to see the Nagakuga weapon yet, because we don't have the items, so it's gonna be a question mark, question mark, question mark like that. 19010, 19 water. Not bad. Nagakuga. Jura Saber. Negative 10 affinity. Gale Scimitar. Uh, dark Scythe, Bone Scythe, Tree, Dark Scythe, Tormentor, 220, negative 10, Green Sharpness. Uh, 
Oh, look at this. This hand-me-down sword? 120, 10 affinity, 7 fire. We can upgrade that to this. 180, 10 fire, 10 affinity. Not sure why you do that, but... Rampage blade, and then we don't... We haven't done any rampages. Right? So can we upgrade the stuff that we're wearing? Yes. Oh, I haven't been upgrading these. Look at that. I'm at level 4 out of 9. So as you as you tier up, as you uh, increase your hunter rank, you can also upgrade your gear. Do I have materials for the Lagombi one yet? No, I don't, right? No, not even close. Upgrade... Forty-eight, so this is forty-four. I'm running out of armor spheres. Especially since once I make the Once I make the the new armor, I'm gonna have to upgrade that again as well, so. I need to go collect armor spheres. Uh, at some point we're gonna to need to go grinding a lot. Just grind for for materials and things. In any case, we upgraded our weapon, we upgraded our armor. So the next time we fight a powerful monster would be easier. I think I should have upgraded my armor sooner. The last fight, well, like we, we died in two hits, right? I don't think we needed to do that. I think if we had upgraded our armor, we wouldn't take quite so much damage. Okay, who wants to talk? Gathering hub entrance? Ah. Oh, where's the case? Yes, it's case. you never guess what happened. I went to the flooded forest to find some fish to make my bunny dango taste even better. Fish dango? But then, a stupid nagakuga came crashing through the forest, making a huge racket, and chased away all the fishies. So I went to a different spot to fish, but then, uh, Chura, uh, Jura, Jura Doda. Wait, I got it. A uh, Jura Todas. Jura Todas, big stupid Jura Todas showed up and started flinging mud everywhere. <laughs> The fishies were gone, I got covered in mud, I didn't catch anything. It was literally the worst! Could you please do something about those dummies for me, please? And maybe throw in a punch or a kick for me too. Hey, <laughs> hey. Sure. Um, hey, listen, there's this, uh, this thing I feel like I can only truly talk to you about. I want to make some dangles that are really healthy so everyone stays in tip-top shape. <laughs> healthy dangle? I've been reading some books with Otem... with Otemai about farm aceuticals. Oh. Like what stuff is good for you and all that stuff. But hands-on experience is better, right? And for that I need some stuff that might be a teensy bit hazardous. And no one does hazardous like you, SKC. Could you maybe possibly give me some? Oh. Somnicath Sedative and Pookie Pookie Sack Plus. But this no stango improved. I guess so. Yes, in case you know, I'm super grateful that you always stop by to order bunny dango, right? By the way, do you know what a quality wyvern egg is? So they're this super expensive, hard to get ingredient, but people say they're the yummiest, bestest eggs ever. Imagine if I made bunny dango with them, they'd be the yummiest too. But it takes so much time and effort to get one myself, not to mention the whole danger thing. But you don't mind a little danger, do you, SCKC? You'll get one for me, won't you? Deliver two quality wyvern eggs. You're asking a lot, lady. Oh, SCKC, hey, hey, listen. Guess what? We've reworked the recipes for all my usual dango to be even yummier than ever. The whole tea shop was busting their butts to make them super duper yummy, so you should totally order some ASAP. Okay. you help me? I have come to a conclusion, spe specifically on how I should go about sharing my artistic gift with the world. 
Big things catch attention, do they not? That means if I were to write down my poetry with a big brush, it would too. <laughs> uh, it's a shame few others will ever achieve such levels of genius as I. You said it, lady. Anyway, I would like you to gather the materials for making such a brush. Meanwhile, I'll be composing a bomb. Oh, I have these already. Glaive? <laughs> brush glaive. <laughs> You know, we still haven't seen the long sword. The long sword uh, joke weapon. Ah, I see you've brought my materials. Thank you, Hunter. I've been hard at work myself, but I may have hit some sort of writer, writer's plateau. It is so heavy. The weight of my words ink down? No, this giant brush. That's beautiful. <laughs> ah, that actually might have been my worst composition yet. <laughs> oh, by the way, I thought it might be helpful to share that you can also forge a giant brush at the smithy. Go ahead and take a look at it, if you're interested. Is anyone ever going to give me the longsword version? <laughs> Heh, about time. ICKZ, rare to see you without a pedal lace on your arm these days, isn't it? Since they seem to be proven helpful to you, how about a little upgrade? This will be the last time though, you've gone and made yourself a top-notch hunter. You don't need old Fugan trying to help you out. <laughs> It looks like you haven't collected every kind of petalase out there just yet, but hey, you can do so whenever the fancy takes you. Alright, off you go then, Squirt. On to greater hunts, greater heights, and greater honors. Now get to it. Wahaha. Cool. More equipment upgrade? I have an important matter to discuss. It took some help from Nakago and the others, but we can now forge more kinds of decorations for you. Oh, I didn't look at that. You'll be faced with some grueling hunts from here on, I'm sure. Make sure your gear doesn't leave you lacking. Can you give me, like, good decorations? Decorations, create decorations. Bubble Joe 2. Friendship Joe 2. Destroyer. So this is Pathbreaker. Heartbreaker 2 gives you one level. And you need Zenoga and Ambervang and Diablos tail <laughs> Oh no, Diablos is. Blind resistance. Goblet Jewel. Increases eating speed protection. Has a predetermined chance of reducing the damage you take. It's a. Uh, Two slot jewel for level one divine blessing. Something cat scale wall run. Um, not that useful the war war and drew. Why bug? Grinder speed sharpening. Item prolonger. Recovery medicine. Drain exhaust power slider affinity sliding. Sliding increases your affinity for a short time. Bomber Blaze Stream Boat. Hunger Resistance. Hmm. I can use this to get Hunger Resistance. So then I can... Use more um, Botanist and... Geologist gear. Dive, Diversion... Arc resistance, rodeo, fortitude, geology, botany. Oh, we can also do this. We can also use this to increase our geology and botany, which I might do actually. Pep Ju anti power antidote. This is Brady Zuchi Kuleyaku. Still nothing that really helps. My long sword. Hmm. But manage equipment, change change equipment set I can't go to sets here. Uh manage equipment equipment loadouts gathering This loadout. Set decorations. I have two, three, four, five, 
Oh yeah, that's pretty good actually. I have more hunger resistance than I actually need. So I have so I want um two botanist and one geologist. And then I guess two war runner, right? Two botanist, one geologist. War runner. <laughs> two, two botanist, one geologist. And then war runner. I don't have enough materials to craft two of these. I need to kill another Bishatin. But for now, this isn't bad. So we want like geology. Botany, War Runner, and then Botany, and then Muck Resistance? Not that useful. Alright, so now. Now our status is. Max Botanist, Max Geologist, Max Hunger Resistance. And uh, two in the war run. And if we ever get another Bishatin, we do have a slot for another war, war run gem. Nice. Alright, let's save this. Uh, manage equipment, equipment loadouts. Save, register loadout. Very good, and then go back to this. Do I have muck resistance? On this? Match equipment, set decorations. What is that? Master Mounter? That's Mark Resist. That's Mark Jew. Okay, I can see that. Mark Jew. Not sure if that's that useful, to be honest. Let's keep talking to people. Hi, yes, Kisi. How's hunting with the Palamutes going? The buddy Smithies were telling me that they really want to get better at making Palamute equipment, but they need more practice. Ah. If you order some gear from them, not only will you get some nice stuff, but you'll also be helping them out. And me as well. Once they've had enough practice, come talk to me and I'll give you some Palamute gear as thanks. Forge 15 pieces of Palamute equipment. How do you do this again? Forge Palamute equipment? 15 pieces. Don't have any scraps there. Should we just craft the best stuff? Um, water, poison. Um, negative 10 affinity. This seems really good. Um, Girotodus, Shatin. What I want is sleep and stun if possible. No, nobody has sleep or stun. How many scraps can I get? I can get some scraps. I need two, three, and I need four scraps for that. Okay, before I do anything crazy, I just wanna craft random stuff because I just wanna do that quest, right? One, two, three. Um, bone scrap. That's six more. 
How many more does he want? Okay, three more Palamute gear. Forge Palamute equipment. Oh, I should probably get the high rank. <laughs> High rank scraps? To sure. In fact, is this better? I'm, this is better than what I'm wearing. Oh, even the, even this is better than what I'm wearing. Okay, I see. Okay, well that's an upgrade. Let's save the uh, expensive materials. Oh, that's cute. Look at that. Bones, alloy... I guess it's Kamura. Nope, I don't have that either. Um, bone? No, that's negative affinity. Alloy? Uh, how many ore scraps can I get out of this? Okay, upgrading my my buddies. Hey, look, they're matching. They're wearing matching armor. Oh yeah. Thanks for your help, Mr. KC. It's much appreciated. Mm. I'm sure they have the hang of making Palamute equipment now, which not only benefits them but everyone. And here's the Palamute gear I promised. I know you'll go on to accomplish great things with it. Blitz scroll, whatever that means. Oh, hey, studio. I should probably um, change the equipment on my dog because I don't think the heal scroll actually heals me. <laughs> I think the heal scroll heals Douglas and not me, right? Can detach from its wearer and chop on autopilot. Attack the business spot to deal more damage. Interesting. Healing all? No, no. It heals all in its vicinity. No, that's fine. Heavy strike? Throw arm? Gilly scroll, diversion scroll, rock steady scroll, blitz scroll. Races penalties, attack speed, effects last for a minute time. Yeah, no. Attacking and defending. Maybe we should attack more. Stalkor Fang? Let's try that. I'm not entirely sure the... the umbrella was actually doing anything. Buddy Plaza... The time has come. SCKC, I have quite an important message for you. We have modified the male scenarios kites so that they are now able to survey further off territories. This means they'll come across new different materials to collect. If you have no problems with it, I'd like to get started right away. Sure thing, Chief. I still don't have the third submarine. That's everyone. Let's go back to the gathering hub and I'll take a break. The next goal is to craft a full set of Barioth armor. High rank. See you next time. <laughs>